Hey YouTube viewers, this is um uh, one of my newer leopard geckos I've had for a few months. Um, I haven't done a video on him just because I already have a video on other leopard geckos. But my other leopard geckos are in a smaller cage and I just figured let's just show him for now. So he is a standard male leopard gecko. He has a genetic thing that he's been bred for with their, these giant eyes as you can see. He is very big, very colorful. He, I believe they're called frog eyes, and he's very big, like I said again. And he loves crickets. They eat, I don't know. Alright, so he has no interest in it right now. But this is a standard 10 gallon setup kitting tank for him. He hides in the hideout, and there's a water dish and some egg crate for the crickets um, and heat. So they are actually an arid, uh, they're from the arid region. Um, I, don't, I don't remember what part of the world they're from, but I know they're arid creatures. So um, rocks are good things, something for them to climb on. This is just cocoa fiber, you can do cocoa fiber. Um, sand, I wouldn't suggest. Um, since arid is dry, um, rocky soil, um, that's pretty much it is. It's not sand, nothing, you know, stupid like that. That's why most of these guys die from impaction with sand. Um, so that's just another thing. These guys are nocturnal, so I just woke them up. Um, so they don't need a UVB bulb. They just need a UVA, which is heat, just to simulate some st sunlight and heat. Um... And I have a 40 watt, 40 watt house bulb. They really don't need a, a light, um, but I keep some heat. And right now I just have a light bulb, regular 40 watt bulb, and it gives off enough heat for him to keep him warm. And it stays about the 80s in here for him. Um, in the winter, I'll be getting an actual uh, light bulb, heat bulb for him. Um, but until then, he's doing great in this, and he doesn't really care because they're nocturnal. Um, so that's just something for them. They need water, um, they eat their own shedding, which isn't a benefit. They poop in their own corners. I don't know where he poops at. I know he poops, I just don't know where. Um, and they just poop in one, that one area, and they're very clean. It's like keeping a cat. They poop and pee in a litter box, and that area of the litter box. Um, and they drink out of the water, and they pretty much act like cats. They walk like an alligator, and they have claws, they're not sticky-toed. So that's another thing. Their tail, they store all their nutrients in there. That's why it gets so fat. Um, so if you have a fat tail in there, it means he eats well, and he's a fatty. <laughs> Just a general um, thing there. Um, wide range of colors. He's just a common albino, pretty much. Um, you know, pink and yellow. Um, so that's, you know, another thing to show you guys. Um, I'll keep you updated.